With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let us solve this question. The question says that C5H11Br plus NaCN gives A which on hydrolysis gives B plus NaOH in presence of CaO we get C. C has a formula C5H12 which can give four structural isomeric monochlorodiv. What is the structure of C5H11Br? So in this question we have to find out the structure of C5H11Br which is the reactant in this sequence of reaction. And here we are given the C having the molecular formula C5H12 and it can give four structural isomeric monochlorodiv. Now basically for finding the structure of C5H11Br there is no need to solve this equation because here we have already given the formula of C that is C5H12 which is the final product here. But let us see the reaction. Right, so we have here C5H11Br, C5H11Br. We don't know the structure of this compound but we know that when it will be treated with NaCN, so here nucleophilic substitution takes place because in NaCN we have cyanide ion. So it will substitute this bromide ion. So from here we get C5H11CN. Right, so this is the product A. Then hydrolysis of A is done. So we can write down C5 H11 C triple bond N. We can write like this. Now when its hydrolysis will be done, now there will be OH negative ion in H3O positive. So this OH negative ion will attack this carbon and this bond will break like this. So here we get C5 H11 C. Here we get OH and there here we get double bond N negative. So, when there will be N negative, then hydrogen ion will attach here. So, we get NH. Right. So, what happens again on hydrolysis? There will be one more OH group here. So, again we get here C5H11C OH OH and here we get NH2. Right. And in Last step again on hydrolysis, there will be again substitution of OH negative ion here. So from here we get C5H11COHOH and OH. Now here on the same carbon atom we have 3 OH group which is not at all stable. So what happens? As you can see on this oxygen atom there will be lone pair so it will be transferred here and there will be removal of this OH group and so from here we get C5H11 C double bond O and OH right one OH group will leave so there will be removal of water molecule. So this is the final product which is B. Then B is treated with NaOH in presence of calcium oxide. So here decarboxylation will take place. There will be removal of carbon dioxide gas. Right. So from here we get C5H12. There will be removal of carbon dioxide. So we get C5H12 which is C. Now C5H12 can give four different structural monochlorodiv and it is only possible when there will be four different carbon atom and we have only one compound with formula CH3, CH, CH3, CH2, CH3. So this is the only compound with molecular formula C5H12 which can give four monochlorodiv because if we count the carbon atoms here this carbon and this carbon is same so when there will be substitution on these carbon we get one product then this is different then this is different and this is different so four different products are obtained here so this will be the answer 
so if this is the c5h12 then c5h11 br will be ch3 ch ch3 ch2 ch2 br so this will be the structure of c5h11 br and it is given in option a so here option a will be the correct option so this is the answer option a is the answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today